been 21 days since the ground here opened up and now that sinkhole is mostly filled back in, but the people who live in this apartment building right next door have not yet been allowed back in. Inspectors just went through the apartment building today to see if it is structurally sound. The police chief says those findings will likely be released tomorrow, and he hopes that the residents will be back in late tomorrow afternoon, but he admits that is optimistic. We asked one woman who was out of her home for three days because of the sinkhole how she feels the borough is handling the situation. Uh, I don't know. It's, it's just a mess, the whole place. I guess they're doing the best they can. The chief says today's rain has also slowed things down. He also says the fact that many asphalt companies are closing down for the winter season this month, that may also delay the process because that's one of the last steps that they still need to do here. Right now, he says the price tag is upwards of $300,000 and is expected to grow even more. In Lancaster County, Caitlin Smith, News 8.